back at the King Wash for another day. And I want to do a super quick run round. Run around, get money. And invest in Dylan's stuff straight away. That is, we're going to do it this episode. Don't care what you say, we're going to do it. Oh, my beard is making my nose so itchy. See, now I've bearded up, I kind of want to just grow it out for the winter. I think that's my plan, just grow it out for the winter. Oh, that's full, nice. Right, so... Great! Oh, I thought I'd get a radical. I wanted a radical. Oh, we've got some machines full. It's always a good sign. Come on. Come on, big guy. Oh, you are full. Nice. Go you. Lump a gopher. Pick up trash while I'm at it. Because, you know, I forgot to go past this area anyway. People are so lazy. There's a bin and right there and they put it on top. People are so lazy. Alright, I've got a full trash bag there. Nice. Let's uh, empty all of these. Is there anything else full? To be honest, I think we might be able to do it. Come on. Did we get this one? Oh! I see a broken down machine. Blockchain! Not you, I thought you were better than this. I thought you were better. Alright, let's have a look at the to-do list. Um, da -da -da. So there's another Zombat 2 one, which we can jump on and do. And a big guy one. So yeah, we could do those two. It's easy enough. Come on. If I put this in, I, I want to say we're there, but we might be just a tiny bit off. Let's have a look. Oh! Like the tiniest bit. I swear, if I go throw this trash in the bin... Alright, if I get the trash in... Then we need to just, like, collect one more thing. Plus, to be honest, we do need to save for that, that an X machine as well, so... We're not out of the woods just yet. Come on, any more, any more gum? Anyone else want to be disgusting? Put gum everywhere, no. Toilet, do you want a break? Toilet break, no. Come on, guys, be be a little bit disgusting. For for my sake. Come on. I can't even remember what the last machine is. All right, if we just collect these quick, that will give us more than enough to then invest in Dylan, and then get on our way to the final machine of this extension. Come on. There we go. Keep going. Nice. Alright. So that's 3,500. There we go. We've done it. We've invested. We are now investment masters. We know everything about investments. Now we need three, three and a half grand for the final machine. I'm sure we can get that. I'm sure we can do it. Now, 
to do lists. Let's play some Bugai. It's a bop. I don't know, if I just if I just keep adding to this, then I just need like one yellow to shoot. Now if I just get that like there, goal done. To do list done. See, nice, easy, quick to-do list right there. Right, we're going to try and do all the to-do lists. So, bullet weapon, 20 enemies. We're on it. Come on, let me play. Fuck you then. I want to play you. No, I don't want to play you. I want to play you. Be playing hard to get right now. Alright, we'll do this one first. Alright, we need like 3,500 and we got 300 so far. No, I don't want to play you. If I sneak up on it, no, you're not having fun. Let's let's move you. Let's put you over there. There we go. You're just a little bit nervous. Just a little bit nervous about the other. Alright, let's just double check. Alright, that is the right one. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Maybe that was nine, ten. Eleven, twelve, thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Nineteen. One more. There we go. Two more. Alright. As much as I want to keep playing that, we need to do the other to-do list. So what was the last one? Beat 75 enemies with the shotgun. Oh, shotgun one again. Alright, we can do this. We've already done it once, so we know we can do it. There we go. Come on. Kill them all. Come on, I want the shotgun, please. Someone drop me the shotgun. Come on. Yo, Ginger, how are we doing? Yo, everyone, how are we doing tonight? Doc Norway, Scruffy, how are we doing? And for any new faces as well, welcome to the stream. How have we been this evening? What, what game have we been playing? Sorry, I can't look at the chat as often as I need to. Oh, fuck's sake. See, that's that's what happens. Try and, try and read chat and play this at the same time. And I end up dying.
how was the uh, how was the stream? What uh, what were you jumping into tonight? Because I've I've seen a lot of notifications about other people going live after I started or just before I started, but I didn't actually read any of the things. Got like a thousand hours. Damn. To be honest, I was getting there with CSGO at one point. CSGO and uh, Volstock, I've got like 200 hours on. Just my Switch, so yeah, a thousand hours. Alright, yeah. It's not as crazy as I thought. Oh, sorry, sorry. Sorry, only a hundred... Uh, sorry, only 880. Only. Rookie numbers, come on. Alright, basically, I am currently trying to do a to-do list item so I've done two out of three for today and I need to kill 75 enemies with the shotgun which I've I've played this game enough that I can do it die mm -hmm. right, I got the combat shotgun already I just need to keep killing things Oh, I'm going to nade you. There we go. So how was the stream? How is everyone's evenings or days, depending on where you are in the world? How are we all doing? Oh, that was nearly a mistake. And if you uh, if you have just joined the stream from Jinjars and you like what you see, think about dropping a follow. Mm -hmm. It's the one thing I never do. Every time someone raids me, I never, you know, do the whole selling myself thing. I need to do that more. Die. Oh god, loads of zombies. Get him. Oh, I didn't. I didn't actually mean like the. This weapon, the uh, flamethrower, is good. But I didn't actually mean to pick it up. That's the problem. It's good, but I didn't actually want it. So as soon as something else is easily accessible, and isn't going to kill me as soon as I pick it up, there we go. Because that is the trouble. You get loads of zombies around you, you try and swap weapon, and then you die straight away. Oh, like that. God damn. How many was that? How many did I get with the combat shotgun? Oh, I got 56, and I needed 75. Is that in one run? In one game. Okay. Looks like we're going to go again. We're going again. Right. Just need to get the combat shotgun. And do I... Just to double check. Right. I still need to do some airstrikes as well. So, if you have not seen this game before, we are playing RK Paradise. Um, from the wonderful <laughs> from the wonderful people at nosebleed interactive and of course Y productions um, I'm not gonna lie to you I'm lead QA at wired so I've played this game far too much already uh, already completed the story mode on my switch almost there on my ps4 because I want the platinum um, and I'm getting there on PC now as well so I yeah between testing and actually playing at home, I've played this game far too much. So really, I should be really good at everything. But I will still fuck up, regardless. Like that. I think it's the uh, the mix of the tiredness and the drinking that's uh, getting me. Oh yeah, no, no, yeah, Ginger, this is work. I'm I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna say to Kevin. 
uh, on Monday. Oh god, I'm really tired now. I'm gonna say to Kevin on Monday. <laughs> I'm gonna say to Kevin on Monday that I need to claim the last three hours as overtime. That's, uh, I'll, I'll see how that goes for me. I'll just claim the last three hours as overtime. Claim my uh, claim my beers on expenses. Well, that's how it works. Well, you know, overtime might be like time and a half. Or you know, I'll, I'll just be like, oh yeah, you know, I was playing for like four or five hours. I'll just take an extra day off. <laughs> He's good. It's one nice. I can't remember when. I, I think I bought these beers like when I went away in August, and they've they've just been sitting in my fridge since. So they need they needed using really. We needed to clear space in the fridge, so I've I've taken one for the team and said, look, I'll do my part. I'll clear the fridge of all the beer. Because you know I'm, I'm a good husband like that. There you go, kill them all. Now, I need to get that shotgun. So I either need somebody to drop it, or I think I need 150 coins? 150 coins, I think, to buy it. Let's check. Oh, only 100. Okay, so we're halfway there. Oh, these, these are good weapons, and we're getting good drops, just not the ones I need. Oh, see, I, I have found that my beer taste has changed massively. That I, I'm just going to claim it's because of my dad now. That I used to just drink, like, you know, Strongbow, uh, Strongbow, Foster, Stella, you know, like, that stuff. But now I'm on, like, you know, I'm on Ale now. So Spitfire, Old Speckled Hen, you know, stuff like that. What I would, what I used to consider as Old Man Beers, just because my dad drank. <laughs> That's what my dad drank. So I'm now on the Old Man Beers. Yeah, it was literally like suddenly I just hated like Heineken and stuff. Uh, I'll still have the odd like bottle of Corona and stuff. I haven't had a beer in 33 years, damn. Do you, do you drink other things or is it just beer you don't like? Because there, there were a few years that like any time I went to a house party I used to take a six pack of Six pack of um, Red Bull. Six pack of Red Bull and a big bottle of Jaeger. And basically make Jaeger bombs, but in like a pint glass. So you used to drink. Oh, champagne is good. I used to drink Jaeger bombs by the pint. So, like, do like four or five shots of Jaeger and then just top it with Red Bull. And that used to just be me for the night. Just, you know six of those and I'm golden but yeah no champagne is good which actually reminds me I I have far too many bottles of champagne because my wedding almost a year ago now last November my wedding everyone bought a champagne so like you know the good people at Wired got us a very nice bottle of champagne uh, Catherine's work at the hospital they all chipped in got a bottle of champagne uh, at the wedding, people just bought us champagne. We paid for bottles of champagne at the wedding and brought those home. So we, at one point, we had like seven bottles around. Oh, and my wife, uh, my wife passed her degree, finished her degree. So bought a bottle of champagne that was then never opened because she started working the next week. Um, See, so yeah, we've got far too many bottles of champagne. So I'm, I need to take that, at least one, 
when we go away uh, in November. Um, yeah, I, I need to start drinking more and more champagne. Otherwise, you know, we'll never get rid of it. Oh, see, I, I was the same. I realised that we got far too much alcohol in the house. Like, normally we don't drink at all. But for some reason, like, from the summer, we've now got loads of alcohol in the house that will just sit for ages. So I was like, fuck it. I have a drink tonight. I'll have a drink tonight, get rid of some of it. Job done. It is it's the perfect excuse, really. It's, it's the excuse of, oh, we need to clear space in the house? Oh, might as well just drink. Perfect excuse. You're doing a service. Alright, I... Oh, okay, I don't quite have enough. Alright, nade there. They need to buy a shotgun again. Pow. Oh, no! How many did I get? Probably not enough. Um... <laughs> Champagne is great. It, it just is. I remember there is a picture somewhere that I still need to share on social media of me at the wedding reception where I've got like my plate of food in front of me and I've got a bottle of Corona that people just kept buying me because they saw I had one and then they were just like oh he likes that so I just kept buying it I got a bottle of Corona then a bottle of wine or sorry a glass of wine then I've got my champagne and my wife's champagne because she doesn't like it. So I've got like, four drinks in, fr <laughs> in front of me. And I'm, I'm surprised I wasn't more drunk. I'm very surprised. But at the same time, like that night, I did just fall asleep. Still like fully clothed. But, you know, got, got into the room, sat down in the nice comfy chair, and just fell asleep there. Still, like, in my full suit and everything, <laughs> shoes on, everything, just fell asleep in the chair. So, I was probably fairly drunk, but... Yeah, having, having to drink for my wife as well, because she doesn't like most drinks, was the main challenge. Talking of, quick pause. There we go. There is my drinking for tonight done. Not gonna have any more. Because that involves getting up out of my desk and going to the fridge. Oh, my, yeah, my, the night my, it was cracking. My wedding was absolutely amazing. Being a wedding, we spent far too much money on it. But it was well worth it. Run. Die zombie, you die as well. Come on, I just wanna, I just wanna do this one. I just need to do this one to-do list item, and then I'm golden. Mm -hmm. Just need to get more kills with this shotgun. Come on, where are you? Oh. Oh my god, that was far too close. I keep doing that, I get too close. Fuck. Change gun, I didn't mean to. I keep getting too close to the zombies. Like, to the point where they could probably get me. Die! See, part of me thought, oh yeah, I'll play arcade for a bit and then I'll switch to, like, Call of Duty or something. I feel too tired to play with you now. Not normally, well, I am normally up this late, but I'm normally not. Fuck's sake. I'm normally not playing games this late. 
Alright, I think we're going to leave this game for now. We're not going to be able to do the uh, to-do list. But, look how, look how much we got through already. Oh, we've got this cool little door. We've already invested in uh, Dylan's company, Freeburn Interactive. And, uh, yeah. We're now gathering money to get our last arcade machine of this extension. 